Welcome back, everybody. We are once again here in Rift. In Gloamwood, second zone of the Guardian playthrough, and we got a request to do, so we're gonna head off into whatever direction they want us to go for that, and uh, use our new mount, because why not? Kinda seems like all of the... All of these are kinda sp spread around a bit, so... So there's a quest over here. Hello. I wonder a ward against goblins created venomous treated of venomous wounds and choked on poison gas. This is worse. A toxic mixture of Trent sap and standing stone stuff is very unstable. Discover its true use by gathering these components and testing the goblin venom on the goblins of Glumwood. Best of luck. Alright, so we've been given a uh, thing here for us to do, I guess. We found the forest altar at least. Are you here to help? Memories of this forest is as old as any language, Cleric. Neither axe nor fire can tame these ancient woods. Those who die in the wars rage here are only reborn among her roots. I have been so weak, drained, since the rifts first tore through this wood. Perhaps the ancient remedies of old may help. Ancestral trends cultivate a plant that only flourish under their care. I need you to gather some for me in hope of restoring my strength. May you live a thousand years. First, however, I guess we should head back a bit here just to be able to uh, deal with this quest that seems kind of out of the way compared to everything else. Plenty of bats and prowlers still around. Is this gonna be too steep? No, I'll just about get up here. Alright. Here we are at Solemn Outlook. Yeah, it's definitely in our level range, so I'm not gonna be uh, too uppity about that. Surprised that these enemies are neutral though. I think a restless spirit would be pretty aggressive. Alright, let's go talk to whoever is up here, I guess. Unless they're in, if they're not inside this house, then the stone idol is probably gonna be or the storm idol is probably gonna be an issue. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. Alright. gonna do this. <laughs> just do damage all over here. Level 22? Alright.
All right, let's see here. We're putting it into another one of these. Our dodge is now derived with 100% of our intelligence. All right. Just a lot of passives to keep ourselves alive for a little bit longer, really. Oh, yep. Yeah. Okay, they're back. Ah, good to see you. These flowers are beautiful. Jenia always had a good eye for such things. Thank you, Olivu. You've endangered life to ease her pain, but I urge you not to linger. The voices of the curse pray for your death, but they do not match the voice of my heart. To that tire, Terry, Traveler, for on these grounds is a foul curse. Each day it is harder for me to resist its lure to badness. I fight its grass for one reason, to ensure my sister receives this charm, and the message to never return to this place. Do not fear me, though I am dead. I mean you no harm. Just be wary. Not all of my deceased relatives are as cordial as I am. Welcome to the Solemn family home. Our proud line can be traced back to the Founding Fathers of Glomwood. Yet, what isn't clear is how our family became cursed upon dead. Whenever one of us dies, our spirit does not pass to the soul stream, but instead becomes bound to these grounds. As time passes, we become mindless spirits that wander these hills for eternity. Yet others of my clan have returned as vengeful specters, exacting their hatreds on anyone who had trespassed on our grounds. I don't know how much longer I have until I become a mindless spirit, but I'll do what I, good I can for my family with the time I have left. Test of luck. Great sun, an ascendant. To break the curse, you must banish the most powerful of my deceased ancestors. You can raise them by placing potent instances from the restless spirits atop their graves. Make no mistake, your death is all these wraps desire. Good luck. Uh... Okay, I need to collect some potent essences from the stuff around, so okay. This explains why I didn't have it. cap though, don't I? Oh, there we go. <clears throat> Alright, we got a planar essence in there. Let's go ahead and put this on. There we go. All right, I do believe we need one more. There's one. Alright, let's go wake up uh, this family reunion over here. <laughs> Yeah, I do like this zone though, because it's a darker kind of zone, and I'm always a fan of that kind of thing. Something with darker ambience than the usual.
Urtrude here has actually a little bit of like some HP regen going on, which is curious. Yeah, I'll take the healing potion, why not? Ah, good to see you. You banish the spirits of the solemn ancestors out of you, and you and you are not yourself dead. Leave all these still holds true. The power here is beyond you. I don't know about all that, but we must banter again sometime. Okay, let me just uh I guess everything else is up this way, so I guess we'll head back that way. The narrowing trail. So we'll go ahead and beat up some goblins here. So we're looking for dark, dark rocks. This guy doesn't have a spider with him, at least. In fact, when we were back in Silverwood, the uh, goblins were. Being, it was said the goblins were coming from Glumwood here, so I guess it's. Oh, uh... well, this guy didn't drop any. Trent stuff? That's strange. Yeah, there's something over here that we need at least. Doctor. Well, this guy is a vile shot. I don't know if we hit one of those before. I think the other ones we were fighting were a different kind of goblin thing. Maybe I just wasn't paying attention. Either one is quite possible, really. Okay, this is gonna be a little, uh...
actually sort of amusing that I can barely just stand here and do this. My word. <laughs> Let's go ahead and check out this corpse over here. Okay. Unfortunately, our mace right now is just so powerful that it's probably going to be a while before we actually replace it. So I guess I'll go ahead and get rid of that, I guess. How they didn't aggro on me there. <laughs> okay, that's all the sap we need. Uh, for our cards quest, we actually have to go kill like another type of goblin entirely, apparently. But we found something over here we can kill. These ones must be more uncommon, because I definitely did not see these guys around a moment ago. Oh, those guys are the Trents, okay. find more of the trents around first thing I guess there's one over there I need to get around away from these bar feeder guys and uh This gives me no variety, so I guess I'll go ahead and take it. <laughs> so this is really just kind of an eclectic lot on area for sure. Finding any of the other goblin type I need to find. Okay, just one more needed. Actually, I need two more because I need five in all for my courage quest with them. Well, apparently, I just need to go right over here for the uh, forest altar one, so I should probably just go do that. It straight up looks like I could go through here, especially as a dwarf, but apparently not. Greetings. 
The essence of these Amori roots have reopened my mind to the wood, allowing me to perceive the spear of death and joy of life simultaneously. I can remember the death rith, the servants of Regulus poured forth, killing man, Trent, and the Abana alike. We were defeated so effortlessly. I failed to protect myself or anyone else from their destruction. I am unable to help you further, but my, my power is limited, and it's time for you to return to Grid and Duskin Leaf and tell him what you've learned. Take this locket, inside is the essence of the Amarian root, just enough to continue your hunt through the past. Journey well. Okay, I need to go back and kill one more Trent in this area, and then it looks like I can move on to doing anything else I really want in the other area, so... Reading the forest of the Blackroot Trents work the grip work, the grip of death on the area is weakened. These trends actually come right back. Sheesh. Like no time in between there. Okay, yeah, everything else we need is like... Essentially, I guess it's just two different tribes of goblins like right beside a road on each other on the opposite ends. So these guys, I guess, have dark rocks. Considering they're literally named Night Rock, I guess I shouldn't be uh, too surprised by that. Oh, we got something new, actually. Goblin dropped a crude necklace as it fell. It looks worthless, but perhaps someone in town would find some value in it. I am getting just so many quests. <laughs> I have so many quests right now, it's kind of ridiculous. next to me. Sheesh. Lovely dark rock. Okay, we got the other, the vertebrae we needed at least. <clears throat> now that you slaughtered the night, night rock goblins and bark eater goblins, the people of Glenwood Pines can rest a little easier knowing you're protecting them. Yes, I guess that's true.
Let's just get the rest of the dark rocks here, and maybe we can, maybe that'll be an instant turn, because that kind of feels like it might be, but we'll see. And I believe that quest with all the bones is like for the guy that wants to make necklaces or whatever back at town. Okay, I just need one more here somewhere. Well, somebody is. Oh no, that's just a spider. That's not a goblin. I'm a spider. Is there maybe one in the cave over here? I would assume there'd be goblins in the cave. Yeah, there is. Okay. So we can test just uh, the stuff on goblins. They're unhappy with that fact. <laughs> oh, the venom surges through the creature, making it stronger. Now that's a curious display. So we know they can use this to get stronger then, alright. It's like steroids for goblins. I'm honestly really thinking about maybe doing the summer fest on my other character because... I don't know how long this game is going to keep on going on for and I'm thinking about that fact, like... Should I maybe try and do more events these years and uh be able to know the fact that I got to do them, because, I don't know, it's getting a little, uh, iffy. And Summerfest is, like, one of the biggest ones, so... Yeah, it looks like we just need to really collect one other thing over here, and then we should be... Well, honestly, we'll probably... Yeah, okay, here's another quest over here. Actually, we'll be able to turn one of these in. Okay. Are you here to help? Thanks for eventually come, Ascendant. Little goblins from the plane of fire rattling the goblins of Glumwood, using elixir to enhance, it, enhance their strength. I barely survived the clash of the brutes under the influence of the serum. You must destroy the guild of leadership to drop the supply. Journey well. Uh -huh. Good to see you. My scouts narrowly avoided capture, escaping the deeps. One reported massive stockpiles of this goblin venom you discovered. Destroying their venom stockpiles will enable us to wipe out the goblin war brand. Best of luck. Okay, I think what we're going to do is we're going to collect the collarbones we need from these guys, and then we're going to just go turn on all these quests that we have, because we have a huge amount of quests here. Can't even use that, but alright. That's fine. Like, I think we have enough quests here to potentially like, get ourselves very close to another level up, really. Yeah. 
Oh, there is another goblin attack. I mean, I heard one of them, like, speak on the left side of me off screen. I wasn't sure if it was just idle sounds going on or if it was actually attacking me. Goblins have ejected an untold number of civilians. If you find anything, no matter how insignificant, the surrounding kin would be grateful for its return. Alright. Okay, so these guys don't have anything extra on them at the moment besides just uh, the collarbones. I see you hiding behind the rock there. Alright. It's probably a good thing that you were paid for these up front. Who knows what kind of people actually purchase them? <laughs> Okay, let me see all my quests at the moment, because I have a lot of quests that are just hanging around here, so... Like, practically every... I only have one that goes to the post up here. Beyond that, all of them are back in the main town for the zone, so it's going to be a little bit of a ways back. Oh, this was right in the way of the path, okay. Sheesh. We should also probably hit up the mailbox when we're here, because we have mail of some sort. Hello. What? The Darkwood Alchemists manufacture poison that enhances their strength. It's worse than I feared. This poison spreads among their armies. Our regiments will fail. And Glumwood will burn. Good thing we are here to stop them before that happens. Yeah, good thing. This venomous, too potent a weapon leave in goblin hands. We must take the fight to the darkening deeps, home to the goblin armies that pillage Glumwood. Speak with the waykeeper Sharia. She was brave enough to set up an outpost at the mouth of the deeps. Okay. Journey well. We probably already talked to her, but you know. And then we'll take this split. that we can go ahead and get rid of. Can't actually use that. Okay, yeah, okay. These are unfortunately going to probably be scattered everywhere, if I have to guess. Oh, here's the mailbox right here. Okay, we got a little, uh, pick-me-up here. Can't actually use that. <laughs> Hello. 
Those goblins never part with their necklaces unless their heads parts with their shoulders. Tell me now, is that how you came by it? It doesn't matter. I've always wanted one of these for my collection. I thank you, Claire. Tally ho. Aha, good to see you. Thank you for bringing me this charm. My brother's protective instincts always were strong. My family's cursed. I shall never have peace while they roam this world in agony. Live gloriously, die heroically. <laughs> I would have figured I would have gotten like. A little bit more out of that, but okay. I would have figured the story would have gone on. Wisdom and life. This locket is given to protectors of the forest. My own was passed down through generations. This served as a constant reminder to pay a debt. And Laura's locket may unlock her shrouded past. This must be my chance to help pull my family's pack. We've discovered another forest altar near the Guardian Campman in Tearfall Run. It could be another way of communicating with Laria, or maybe her sister Delayeth. Perhaps the vigil would bless your presence at this altar as they did, at the, did the last. Journey well. <clears throat> Curious, is that like in another location? No, it seems to be a. Uh... Or maybe it is, I'm not sure. Oh, yeah, it is, okay. Probably would make the most sense at the moment, though, to go after the uh, goblin encampment one, I guess. Actually, kind of curious because Golemwood is not apparently a very big area. Hmm. Also, I guess it wasn't quite a level up amount, but you know, it actually did make our experience bar, bar go up quite a bit. Just in that two particular goes, but whatever. This might actually be a level 23 area that we're going into next. It's a Assuredly 22, but there might be some 23 mobs in there. Moonshade way. Does that lead up into... Oh yeah, it does lead up to the Moonshade Highlands. That's neat. They gave us a quest for Moonshade Highlands in the first zone. I had no idea why they would do that. Like, honest to goodness, I was wondering, like... Are they serious? They really think I want to go into a level 40 area, like, Im immediately? have range attacks, you know. Well, it looks like we found at least, uh, something here. Take the family hair room, why not? Hello. Dark and Deeps is teaming up Dark Blood Goblins. Venturing fools and heroes alike disappear here. Go caution, out of you. You know what? Why go down like the the correct way? Let's go down this way. Why not? I'm basically on top of the goblin. Hi there. Yeah, 
cotton cloth. I'll take it. Why not? I shall end this one, though. For the glory of Galamir. Looms, why not? Hi. Kind of actually a pretty nice little spot here because you can barely see it. Another nifty little heirloom spot. There's actually like corpses like all around here. Summer sunfish. Can't actually use that, so I'll just leave it. I think the only thing I can use is like wands. <laughs> that seems to be the only thing they really want to give me. There is a... That is definitely the poisons, I'm pretty sure. That's not good. Okay, that was definitely one specific spot, though, so... That uncovers that. Looks like there's another thing over here, too. It kind of looks like I would have to go all the way around here to uh, get to this first spot. I apparently did it reverse because I did not take the right trail. Scroll of Intelligence? Sure, I'll take that one off. Crew construction of the Venom Stained Key seems to be matching the primitive locks you've seen on cages in the Darkening Deeps. Take it and free a captured civilian. I mean, sure, I can do that, I guess. gonna run my way up because honestly it's it makes more sense for me to do this I think I'm just saying hit by goblins constantly though just because they're too short of a path and not aggro them I guess <laughs> Oh, 
Hi there. Yeah, I apparently did not take the right choice when jumping down there like I did at the beginning. <laughs> A bit musing, all things considered, but you know. I'm guessing, like, the spider cave must be... Like, down below, I'm assuming. I'm assuming it must be like in the spider cave, maybe. I don't know. Definitely like a full on system back here. These goblins are going to die eventually. Okay, we're slowly getting there now. I think the bile shots was doing more damage to me than anything else. Cotton cloth, at least. <laughs> eh, scroll of endurance, that's not too bad. For sure, at the very least, uh, the goblin guy I need to kill is in here. I don't know if. The captive is in here or not, though. That's the closest in a while I've actually came to dying, though. Took, uh, four enemies. Or was it even five? It was at least four, for sure. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh, well, we found this guy at least. Damage to both of them while we're at it. But the power of their venom, these goblins should be no match for the waykeepers. We get men of honor, okay. Okay, that actually might be a good buff for us. Instead of it being a defensive buff, it's definitely an out offensive buff instead. Okay, so there isn't actually another entrance here, it looks like, the entire time. Where is this captive, though? I must have missed the captive at some point, because... It is below me here. There they are. Okay. So I missed them earlier. Thankfully they're not too far away from the entrance though, so it's not really a big deal, I guess. Thank you, Eric. I thought I'd see my last friendly face. I'll get this cage open, but I'll need your help to escape. Let me know when you're ready to go. <clears throat> During my last escape, the goblins caught me and dished out a brutal cuddling. Cudgeling. I thought I was done for, but they locked me up again. I don't know what they're keeping me for. I don't want to find out. Give me the word and we'll make our escape. Thank you okay, so we'll assistance. just go ahead and get out of here then. I'm assuming he's heading for the base camp. Let's 
Do it while we can, friend. <clears throat> we'll definitely have more fights up ahead because I didn't kill any of them up ahead, so. <laughs> At least this one next to the road here on the right, for sure. It's always funny to watch them like walk back five feet and then uh be like, alright, that's good enough. Just keep on walking forward. <laughs> I know they're probably just resetting to where they were right before the aggroed or whatever. Yeah, that's pretty much exactly what they're doing. And we're here, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I hope you don't have to see the inside of a goblin cage either again. Are you here to help? You've gone out of your way to save a life, all of you. The captured citizen you rescued from the goblins of the Darkening Deeps would certainly have met a grisly end without your intervention. A display of bravery like that must be rewarded. Find your friends. Aha, uh -huh. good to see you. Yo, cleric. I've never seen such a blast. The vigil be praised. The explosion echoed through the catacombs of the deeps. No doubt we have struck fear into their hearts. It is a dark day when families must face the loss of a loved one. I'll have the family hammer them should recover and return to them. Your work here will not go unnoticed. The vigil is right to send you. You've crushed the goblins' morale and they are running scared. I can handle things from here, but you should report to for the Dragomir and Glowwood Pines. I want a word of you, the one responsible for exterminating the goblins. We keep her Charlotte. Okay. Journey well. So kind of an interesting thing, because they're sending us to two different places completely. They're sending me up into... Well, one of them, at least, is sending me up into the area that is uh, completely fogged out. So maybe this quest down below, if I go back to it, will... Something over there as well. Let's go ahead and head back to Glowman Pines, I guess. <laughs> yeah, it was pretty good that we started out as level 21 when we did, because this is very much moving pretty much at a pace where we need a day to be a level higher for it, I guess. I don't know. kind of makes sense to overlevel for the zone first and then that'll essentially bounce it out later on through the zone. So that's probably what I'm going to go ahead and just do. Okay, oh, there's somebody down there. Hmm. Alright. 
We're just gonna keep on going up and up. Oh, I bet they're fishing. Like, part of the summer fest is they got summer fishing going on. So this is the legendary cleric, I love you. I've already heard a hundred different tales of how you foiled the goblin plot, but it's not the means that are important, it's the end. So if the goblin's on the run, the people of Glomut can breathe easier. Your deeds call for a celebration, my friend. It has been too long since we had cause to celebrate. Take the Glom Bell, it is symbol by people. Bring it from the ba my balcony so all of Glomut knows there is still heroes standing against the darkness. Enjoy this time, Alavi. The people of Glomwood Pines are in your debt. With the Goblin Pot foiled, my people know a sense of calm they have not had before you arrived. Glomwood Pines was once the jewel of the wood, but now it serves as a lone refuge from the horrors of the Assaultus each day. Now people are distrustful of the outsiders and believe you're... Uh, my people are distrustful of the outsiders and believe your presence worsens the rifts that plague our forest. It may be superstition, but regardless, the more strangers that enter this town, the more trouble seems to appear. As I've told Sanctum, I will not have them use have them use my town as a base for their military operations. I will not provoke the Gauntlets into a four-scale attack on our citizens simply because they can reach war. I am sure you can handle this. Hooray! Take these precious moments out of you and hold them close. They come seldom and far between. Again, all of Glomwood thanks you for your service here. Please, all of you, allow me to express the gratitude of all the citizens of Glomwood Pines. I'm sure Marshal Oakhart and Sheriff Cosman want to thank you themselves after you've spoken to them. Dress the Nightclaw will be able to give you access to our armory. Consider this our humble effort to contribute to our own defense against your through your actions. Good luck. All right. Well, I think this is a good stopping point in any case. It's also a really nice view of the surrounding area, for sure. But next time, we will continue on and see what else the rest of Glomwood has, because we're already, like, halfway through it at the very least. Maybe even two-thirds. So, see you guys next time.